UMass Boston women's basketball at home Tuesday night taking on Colby Sawyer College. The Beacons looking to move to 2-0 on the young season. And early on, it would be all sunny green. Savela Jensen with the miss from the corner green cleans up the boards, lays it home. Beacons ahead by three early on in this one. And then green yet again a little while later. Gets this one on the inbound from Jensen. Jumper from the LEC logo. Puts the Beacons ahead by six, but some shooting woes in the first quarter would find the Beacons behind by three, and they would turn that around real quickly as Meg Dixon with the jumper right there. And then Sonny Green from beyond the arc bangs this one home. Nothing but net. Beacons ahead, 17-15. And then a back-and-forth quarter would ensue. Sonny Green from the corner now from Dixon in the middle knocks that one down. The Beacons ahead by three and then trailing 22 to 20. The Beacons go on a 7-0 run to finish off the second quarter and it culminates in Carrie Ann Farina. His buzzer beater three from beyond half court and the Beacons swing momentum in their favor going into the locker room and coming out of the locker room. The momentum would continue as the Beacons make it a 10-0 run to start the third quarter And in fact, between the second and third quarter would go on a total of 17 straight points before Colby Soar would hit a basket, as you say. Paige Olivier with the miss right there. Sabela Jensen cleans up the board, lays it up, and the Beacons continue to expand that lead as the Colby Sawyer Chargers forced to call timeout. But the Beacons would just continue from there as it's Meg Dixon from the on the arc. Nails that one. The Beacons now up double digits. And then Sonny Green capping it off. Continuing her hot night. This one from the right side. An and one opportunity as she's fouled on the three-point attempt. Green finished the game with her first double-double in her career. 15 points, 10 rebounds. In the fourth quarter, the Chargers would threaten Marissa Holt with that three-pointer. Would cut the Beacon lead to just 10. But then a 12-0 run from the Beacons would help secure the win. As Sabela Jensen with the steal right there lays it home. And the Beacons re-up their lead to 13, but they were not done yet. They would go up by as many as 22 points in this one as Olivier from beyond the arc nails that three. The Beacons now stretch that lead to 15 and force the Chargers to call a timeout with just over four minutes left. But Olivier again, this one from the right side, working in her defender, gets it in. Tough layup, falls. The Beacons lead continues to stretch out. Carrie Ann Farina, explosive from the left side, lays it up and in. And now the Beacons up by 20 points. That would put a dagger in it. And then Sabela Jensen caps it all off with a nice pass from Sierra Brigham to lay it up and in. The Beacons go up by 22 points and end up winning this one 59 to 41 over the Chargers. The Beacons now will head on the road to the Hunter College Invitational this Friday and Saturday in New York City.